Good morning guys, I'm just doing my makeup for the day. I thought I would show you what I'm doing. I haven't got many plans today, I've got a meeting at Gleam, my agents, and I'm probably going to spend the day there working um, because I like to be in an office environment. I always get a lot done and I have a lot to do. Um, right, what am I doing? So I'm going to do my makeup. I'm just going to put on a bit of Chanel serum. I'm starting to really like using this just as a base. Very hydrating. For very natural days, I'm loving mixing the Estee Lauder CC Cream and the Chanel CC Cream. The Chanel one is slightly more coverage, but it's a bit light for me. And the Estee Lauder one comes out grey and then it tints and it's a little bit dark for me. So the mix of these at the moment is really, really good. I'm just kind of going to put a square on the back of my hand of both. And you can just use your hands for this and I really like it for dewy, natural makeup days. I've been wearing this a lot recently. So I watched Grey's Anatomy last night on Sky Living and they said at the beginning this is the season finale and it's a double episode. So I got excited but then I think everyone on Twitter said that it wasn't. There's like the finale's tonight um, in America so it's like two episodes time for us. But it was a really good one. It was very sad but it was like double. Also I think I'm going to change the whole Snapchat at the end of the video thing. One because I never have my camera on me when I'm watching them so I'm not sure logistically how that will work. Also, I've had a few Snapchats from people saying like, I don't want to go in your vlog, but I just wanted to say. So I think it's kind of put off, putting off people from sending me Snapchat videos because they're worried that it means they'll be in the vlog. So I'm not going to do that anymore. It was very nice while it lasted. I'm still going to watch all the Snapchat videos that you guys send me. So send them to me and don't worry, you won't be in the vlog. I might have a few left from when I filmed the other day and I'll put those in if I can. But from now on, let's just say, let's not do that anymore. And you guys can just send me Snapchat videos when you like because I love watching them, especially in the morning. In the morning I get all the ones from people in Australia and New Zealand, which I love. I haven't been to New Zealand, I really want to, but I've been to Australia quite a few times and I spent a month there and I love it. Okay, I'm gonna finish off my makeup now. You don't need to watch this whole thing, it's very boring, so I'll be back with you in a minute. Also, I'm completely obsessed with those Ear Biscuit podcasts. They're so good, they're just like really in-depth interviews um, with really well-known YouTubers and they talk about things they haven't spoken about before so I've done Tyler Oakley and I've done Grace Helbig I'm now listening to Hannah Hart who's like my fave, I love her and it's so good, I think it just shows like even if you haven't got like a dramatic painful life story I think it just shows there's so much more to YouTubers than just what you see in their videos and I really have enjoyed just having it like either I fell asleep last night listening to it, that's why I'm quite tired um, and I've just had it playing while I'm doing my makeup and I like podcasts, I feel like it's nice not to watch something just to have something nice going into your ears. I'm going to get more into podcasts. Everyone says that Serial podcast is amazing, so I might get into that next. Okay, I'm actually going to stay at home this morning and then just head to Game for my meeting and stay there this afternoon. Um, so I'm going to get some stuff done now. I'm going to paint my nails because I need to take a photo for my Sunday nail post. I do a blog post every Sunday on a new nail polish. I actually haven't been buying many new nail polishes recently. I've been very good. Um, this one is from the new Chanel Spring Summer collection, maybe? Summer, I think. Um, and it's like a royal blue, which is quite different to what I usually wear. So I'm going to paint that and see what it looks like on vibrato. But I've got a cut on my nail on this one. I don't know if you can see that. And I just know it is going to sting so bad when I take my nail polish off. Especially if I use this, um, because this is really strong stuff. I like it. It takes off my polish well, but I find it kind of dries out my cuticles a little bit. Um, it's super, super strong. So I'm going to have to be very careful. Okay, I've just taken the photo of my nails. They are like this. I'm just importing it now. Here it is. There you go. Don't really need to edit much. Might make it a bit brighter. I haven't really said anywhere yet because I wasn't sure I wanted to promote it because it is quite expensive to go. But I am going to be at Beautycon London. Obviously, I live in London, so I'm I'm not going to just not go. I really want to go and meet people. And there's loads of YouTubers there as well that I want to meet and say hi to. So I am going to be there. If you guys are already going, then I'm really looking forward to meeting you. But I completely understand if... I don't know if it's sold out, but I know it's pretty expensive. So I understand if people can't go or don't want to go as well. I'll hopefully see you guys another time. But yeah, I'm going to be at Beautycon. So see you there if you guys are going to be there too. Look at this weather. Look at this weather. Yesterday was like the sunniest, hottest day ever. And now it's absolutely pissing it down. This is what we have to put up with in London in the spring. This is the perfect day for my yellow raincoat because it's like a spring, April showers. What month are we in? We're definitely in May. May showers. Um, and it's like, because I've either got my like big 
too hot winter coat or my really light summer coat so this is kind of in between and it's got a hood so no frizzy hair for me today ish all right i'm gonna head to town now i've got one o'clock meeting Ooh, actually i really need to go um, i've managed to convince them to have a meeting in basaba <laughs> so i can just eat yummy food Okay guys, I'm home and massive fail. It's only my first, my first fail in. Rich, what's the date today? 14. So it's like 14 days in. I think I've done pretty well to only now fail. I'm home now and I haven't really vlogged today because there wasn't anything to vlog. After The last thing I vlogged was lunch and after that I went back to the Gleam office and I just worked the whole time. Victoria was there, that was nice, but I didn't want to vlog because there was like everyone in the office and I just worked for hours and hours and hours, went through millions of emails did all the stuff I needed to do and there was nothing to vlog and then I got on the tube to come back and there was no chance of any sort of like swishy swashy are you wanting to go past me? yeah okay <coughs> there was no chance of any swishy swashy filming because what happens in London when it gets so so busy on the tube is they stop letting through that many people so there's like barriers like six or there's, some, there's loads of barriers and they'll only open two so it's like queues and queues it literally feels like you're a cow and you're being like moved around so that was mental, it was hot and the weather today, sorry this is like a full on moan but I'm just like trying to explain what's happening. The weather today is horrendous, like so rainy. I've been wearing my Nike trainers which are down there and I put them on thinking like I'm going to wear some practical shoes because it's raining and I forget that they're like, they're like knit, like knitted, I don't know, not knitted, um, I don't know what the word is and all the water goes in so like my feet are like soaking wet. I know that some of you get annoyed when I moan, but I'm just being me and there's no point in me pretending like, hello, I'm home and I'm making dinner, because that's not how I feel right now. I feel like I've had a really crap day and I'm just not having a good day and I'm feeling really grumpy. So now I'm home and me and Rich need to make something for dinner, but we haven't really got anything in the house, so I'm going to make spaghetti bolognese, which was pretty easy. I don't know. I just thought I should update you guys. Okay, I'm going to make bolognese. I'm going to use two garlic, because I love garlic, onion mince and chopped tomatoes really easy that's how i make mine some people put mushrooms and carrots and other stuff in but we like it just like that we like it quite tomato-y though um so i'm gonna make that now i haven't got any spelt spaghetti left so i'm gonna have normal spaghetti and have stomach cramps all night but it will be so worth it it's gonna be delicious all right i'm just chopping up all the onions and garlic i haven't like got into home clothes yet so i've just shouted up to rich like can you bring me down hoodie, t-shirt, tracksuit bottoms and socks and a hairband, like a full outfit. Um, so this is like a challenge. I reckon he's going to come down with like a really smart, nice t-shirt that I'm not going to want to wear. I'm hoping for like a grey t-shirt and blue tracksuit bottoms and my Disney hoodie. That's what I'm hoping for. Alright, what have you got for me? So you get like black hairband. Nice. Black socks. Nice. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles t-shirt. Good favorite. choice. That is my fave too. Disney hoodie. Rich, I'm so proud. See, I know you. <laughs> and the blue tracks at the bottom. That weren't meant to be mine. Right, let's make some bolognese. Okay, now I'm happy. Hair up. Makes me so much happier. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles t-shirt. Tracks at bottoms. And my hoodie will go on as well. Okay, wait. I've chopped everything up now, so let's do... Onions first, and then this. garlic, and then mince. No. So look how bad the my finger is now since this morning. Let's see if it focuses. I think it's like quite infected. This fourth finger. I'm gonna have to put it in um, warm water and salt water. Put some savlon on. Okay. So this is how I make my bolognese: oil, olive oil in the pan, and then I'm gonna add my onions first. Wait until they get a little bit see-through, and then add the garlic. I'm always freaked out the garlic's gonna burn. I don't really like cooking garlic. It freaks me out. And then we'll add the mince until it goes a little bit brown. Or oh, actually until most of it's brown. And then we add the ch chopped tomatoes. Which is officially the noisiest person to have in the background of a vlog ever. What are you doing? My chicken needs cooking. For when? You've only got one more day. You're not even at work tomorrow. What are you making this for? Well, I just need, it's going to go out of date. So I'm going to cook it and eat it for like breakfast and lunch. 
onions in you see how the onions have gone a bit like shiny and glossy that means it's ready for the garlic when you can start to really smell the garlic that's when you know it's kind of cooking and you don't want it to burn because once it burns it tastes really bitter and then we're going to add the mince okay the mince is in i'm gonna let that go brown and then add in the chopped tomatoes just watching my friend the lean machines whilst we cook okay so the meat's brown now as you can see i'm gonna add in the chopped tomatoes and then season it with salt and pepper okay so this is what it looks like once the tomatoes added i think the longer you cook it the nicer it tastes so I'm going to leave it there for as long as we can. I'm starving though. How hungry on a scale of 1 to 10 are you? Uh, 12. Literally 12. You're so that person that answers things like that. <laughs> this is how much pasta we're making for two people with such pigs. But I always... I don't get full on pasta. I think because it takes... It like, I think... This is correct. I might be making it up. But I think it like expands in your stomach. So it takes a while to get full. Well, with me, I could eat like bowls and bowls of pasta and I wouldn't be full. But then like an hour later, it's like BAM. Okay, it's ready. Off. I mean, look at this portion size, it's ridiculous, and it also looks like poo, but it's delicious, I swear. Doesn't it smell good? It is good. Yeah. There is cheese, I've seen it before. The cheese is, I used it the other day. There's no parmesan, this is an absolute disaster. Bolognese without parmesan is like Lily without Rich. Is this like pecorino? Is that the same? No, I'm just going to do it without. Which one do you want? <laughs> Okay, dinner done, holly eggs done. We're now watching Watchdog because it's a special episode where Claudia Winkleman, if you're not from the UK, she's like a TV presenter. She talks about her daughter who um, Halloween last year, October, just been, her daughter was out trick-or-treating and her Halloween costume, her witch's outfit, caught on fire and immediately went up in flames and she nearly died and it was terrible. And they're now like doing a whole programme on how those outfits, those Halloween costumes, passed all the safety tests, even though they're clearly the most flammable things ever. And it's really interesting, actually, and really sad. And it hasn't got to the bit yet where Claudia Winkleman's talking about it, but she's very brave. Bath time. I don't know what to put into my bath tonight. The options are... Zoella Fizbar. Um, Romotherapy Associates oils, which are here. Epsom salts, which I really like when I've actually got a bad back. I should really do that, but it's just not as like nice. I don't know, I've got loads of stuff here. I might go for the oils, actually. And maybe one of these, just make it smell nice. I like the scent of these, actually. I thought they'd be really sweet. Um, and I think initially when I talked about them, I said they were sweet, but they're not. They're kind of floral and quite fresh smelling. Okay. I like my bath quite hot. I get that from my mum. I remember when I was younger, she used to do the bath so hot. <laughs> I'm also going to listen to a podcast whilst I have my bath. And at the moment, I'm listening to the Colleen Ballinger one. Oh, I'm going to put in one of these. So it's all like fizzy. I'm going to put in a little bit of oils. Which one have I got here? Deep Relax, Revive Morning, and De Stress Mind. Do I want a De Stress Mind or Deep Relax? I think de-stress mind. My mind is a little bit stressed. <laughs> you only really need a cap full of these oils because they're so powerful. I love them. Sometimes I use two. I might use two tonight. Okay, skincare tonight is gonna be Charlotte Tilbury Eye Makeup Remover. Mm, Oscar Renaissance Cleansing Gel. Estee Lauder Advanced Night Repair. And Origins Make a Difference Night. That is what I'm gonna do. So I'm just gonna take my makeup off now and then lie in bed and watch the Vampire Diaries because I just realized I'm really behind. I like forgot to watch it suddenly. The highlight of today has been a very non-eventful, boring day, but my sister sent us all a video of Bailey because he's reading now. Like he's so good at reading. He's five, but like only just turned five. And he's such a good little reader. Let me show you this video, it's so cute. That floats on the breeze your legs are for walking i guess so said caterpillar how cute is that he's so good i can't i just can't believe that you just learn how to read like it must be so difficult <laughs> i just think that's amazing so that was definitely my highlight of today thank you guys for watching the next vlog you will see is on monday and it will be of some of my weekend. I have a main video going up this Sunday, 9.30am, 
UK time. And what is it? Oh, it's me at mine and Anna's beauty chat. So I hope you guys will enjoy that. I'll see you on Sunday and then on Monday. Have a good weekend. Bye. Done and video's done. Um, the, the second part of the video definitely isn't as good as the first. I was running out of battery and time. So, um, and I didn't really know how to